What's up, you pop culture nerds? I am so freaking excited for this, okay? So this is another private signing, and when you guys see this, your guys are, your jaws are gonna hit the floor, okay? So in the Zobi community group, um, uh, JR, which is the owner of Zobi Productions, he dropped a GIF, and then everybody was losing their fucking minds. You're like, oh my goodness, is like, is it, is it Robin Tooney? Is it Nev Campbell? Is it Feruza Balk? Or is it Rachel True from The Craft, right? Remember The Craft? Yeah, well, friggin' he dropped a GIF and he got two of the girls from The Craft to sign. And when I saw this, I was like, holy smokes. Like, this is insane. And here we go, you're about to see. This is insane. I'm just seeing this now, so here we go. Oh, it smells so nice. It's like a, like a new car smell. Oh, it smells so nice. But bam, look at this, you guys. These are limited edition Funko Pops. I'm not even joking, you guys. Zobi Productions is the first company, autograph company, to actually have this private signing done by the actress herself, Feruza Balk. Nobody has these Funko Pops. The Funko Pops are being sold wherever they are where Funko Pops get sold, but Zobi Productions owns the rights to sign have this private signing done. Isn't that freaking insane? So when this was up for for grabs, um, they were limited spots. So I had to jump on it. And I was like, oh my God, like could it be Robert Ro um, Robin Tooney, right? Um, we're waiting for her to drop. We don't know. Um, JR can't really say much about it, but a lot of people have asked constantly about it. But there was two of them from the craft that he dropped. He dropped Feruza Balk, which is this girl right here. And then they dropped Rachel True. Um, and I didn't really want her. I wasn't a fan of her or whatever. But yeah, this was insane. Like. It was in freaking Zane. So this is signed by Feruza Balk. I've seen a couple of these in the group. Um, there, She signed them in orange and green. Um, Feruza Balk's character in The Craft, um, she played like the crazy girl. Um, Cause I guess she got like, you know, power hungry and stuff like that. Um, and she like literally ended, landed herself into a mental institution. And if you guys haven't seen the new craft that came out, I think it's called Craft Legacy um, with, the, with the girls and stuff watch it guys she makes a special cameo in the ending of the film where one of the girls goes and sees her mother nancy and then when she goes in there and she goes it's me your daughter and then when i saw her i was like oh my god like i got off the bed and i was like that's nancy like you don't understand like that's nancy from the craft like that is insane um I just really, I really hope and pray that they do another one so then we can actually bring Nancy's character back because that would be freaking insane. But look, how how cool is this, you guys? That's Feruza Balk's signature. Like, look at that. Oh, again, it's all messed up with the stupid stuff again. Yeah, I know. There you go, I just wanted you guys to look at it better. I'm not gonna open it fully. There we go, I got it. There you go, you guys can get a crisp, clean look at it. Look how freaking cool that is, you guys. That's dope. And the Funko Pop looks to be like in good condition. I noticed people who are like diehard, like autograph, like Funko Pop collectors, they really need to have the Funko Pop in mint condition for some reason. I don't really care personally. It's staying in my personal collection, but most people like to get like the highest bang for their buck, like to have things that are mint or whatever. But again, the sticker right here, matches the thing on the back and it is JSA certified. But props to Zobi, man. They're just killing it, dude. There is some of these actually on Zobi Productions website if you're a fan of Feruza Balk. Um, he I think he's got like three up for grabs or whatever. So check um, zobiproductions.com and leave a like, leave a comment and stay tuned for more because I have more coming. Again, just waiting for signings to happen and again, snail mail because of COVID. But ciao for now.